Hello everyone! Today I will not be showing my face because、uh, it's a vlog. I went to the mall recently, of course, and I really wanted to show you a little bit of、uh, Dubai Mall and, and show you what's new at the stores and、um, just kind of give you the vibe of Dubai Mall and And it's a luxury lifestyle here. Look at this cafe. I haven't been here, but I think I should try someday. Let's go ahead and shop around. And my first、uh, store that I want to show you guys is Saint Laurent. And they have a huge Saint Laurent、um, in Dubai Mall. Let's go ahead inside. And I just was browsing through and wanted to see what bags they have. I haven't been in Saint Laurent in a while, and honestly, they've got so many different bags and like different colors. I really got excited. But look at this one. This is why I cannot go with natural leather. When I saw this, this is just demotivated me to、uh, even look at this bag. Look, it's so scratched up. But I like the croc effect one. Look at this one. This is a really cute one.、Um, it's nice as I like it every day and to go out. But the one thing that I don't like is it doesn't have any closure. As you see, there's no zipper, no flap, it's just wide open. I really like this style. It has a top handle and it's suede、um, with leather flap. It's really nice. I like the color, but honestly, I really like the color from afar, but、um, I'm not into warm and brown tones. Even I'm not into beige as well. So I always admire, but I never go and, and buy it, honestly. And there's a little bigger size、um, in the really like a gray, like dark gray color. I like the combination of gray and gold hardware. I also look at this sunset bag. It's a new style sunset bag, and it's a top handle, it has a back. A back pocket, it has a top handle and a, like a shoulder crossbody. And I'm trying it on showing to show how it is. I really like this, it kind of really reminds me of like like more like a pochette mitty style. This one is actually a good alternative for a boy bag, Chanel boy bag. It does give me this Chanel boy bag vibe, like an edgy style. and Like Chanel quilting and all that stuff, honestly. It's just a really great, great alternative. And I like this one as well. It's the same as the beige sunset top handle、uh, one, but it has a, this one is in, is in the this one is in the gray color. And when I compare these two, I kind of like the beige one more though. Look at this s h e r l i n g bag. This is a Lulu, no, it's like, I, think, I think it's a puffer Lu bag. And it's such a cute color, even though I'm not into s h e r l i n g This is natural, like a sheep's sheep、uh, fur, but I'm not into it at all. But I really like this a lot. The color is just stunning.、And、look at this mini Lou puffer bag in this tweed hot pink color. It's so cute. Honestly, I was never into tweed and I'm never into pinks like this. But this one is such a special one. If you're into like hot pink colors and into tweed, this, is, this bag is it for you guys. I really like Lulu. You guys know, I'm like, this one is my Lulu, the white one. And I really, really like Lulu bags. And I have the medium and the small one. And look at the mini, the toy Lulu. I always want the Toy Lulu, but I was like, am I gonna be too just? I don't know if I should have three Lulus in my collection, but this yellow just really, really cute. And look at this like vanity、um, style bags. I never seen these, these are so new.
and look at this clutch this is a, like a bottega inspired clutch but actually i really like this one much better than the bottega one this is in the quilting and the lambskin and it has a very tiny ysl logo in the back and I had to look at the orange one. The orange one is really cute. It has a silver hardware, but when I compare these two, I think the yellow is better, in my opinion. Would you go for yellow or orange? Please vote. And when I was going out of the YSL, I really, really got stopped by this bag. I was like, oh my gosh, this is a, such a cute bag. Look at this. This is a velvet bag and it's in the green color. And when you just kind of turn it around, it changes. It, it becomes light green to dark green. It has such a beautiful shade. I really, really like this a lot. This is really nice. I was walking uh, by Cartier and I really wanted to show you guys look at this just include ginormous bracelet and the necklace and the ring and the earring honestly look at this bracelet it's just so huge just wanted to show you guys and I was surprised to see that Far Lepage is opening in Dubai soon this is very surprising and I actually really really excited I have for the Parge um, tote bag in this blue color and I love it. It's, it's my perfect travel bag and I'm so excited that they're opening in Dubai. I stopped by Prada and I really like these sneakers. I really like them but unfortunately they are only for men and um, I tried it uh, the, la the smallest size which is 39 but I'm 38 and they were a bit too big. And these are new bags uh, in the lambskin. They are like re-edition uh, utility style bags. And these are, these are cute little bags, but I'm not a really fan of it. Honestly, Prada is a bit, a bit disappointing right now with the bags. Like, look at these bags. Like, what are they? Like, really, honestly. But their shoes are cute. I mean, I've always been a fan of uh, bags and shoes, but... As of now, um, I think they're doing better in their in their shoes, but not their bags. But I had to look at the Prada edition. The green one I have is this one in the middle, and I really like the this green gray one. Um, I think it's a great neutral gray color, which is nice. I mean, I really like how it goes with my with my dress, even with like a flowery dress. It's really nice, but I really, really like this color. The light, like a, there's a little bit darker beige, like more warm tone beige. And then there's a little bit of cooler, like light pink, I, I would say. Like, like there's a pink undertone. And I really like this lighter version. It's so cute. And I stopped by Balenciaga. I wanted to see their new bags. And I was like, what are these, honestly? like shearling I don't know and these are really really tiny city bags I never been in a fan of city bags and I really wanted to see how small they are and they're very tiny you can only like keep your lipstick and your keys probably and cards but nothing more and I wanted to compare with this mini size, this extra like tiny, tiny toy size. I don't know why, but I was never, never into Balenciaga bags. And I once in a while I go and check if I if I do find something, but I never find anything. Honestly, I don't know why. I just admire from afar. And this, these are new Valentino sneakers. Um, yeah, they're pretty much going with a trend and um, yeah and I checked out their bags and they have I mean this like huge Roman stud bags I am not fan at all but this one is cute for summer but they're very very heavy honestly so heavy like I wouldn't want to carry such a heavy bag 
imagine these um, sandals are cute but the roman studs are so huge i'm not a fan i mean this bag is cute but i don't know how practical it is it's just not practical imagine spilling a coffee on top of this yeah i'm not a fan at all but i just wanted to show their bags i mean maybe you guys like it let me know but not really a fan of valentino like valentino is same as balenciaga for me i'm not interested at all yeah not my cup of tea and on the way out i was going through the kids department and saw these cute fendi shoes the boots and look at these oh my gosh these are like rain shoes and um I don't, I don't know they're so adorable look at these fendi little tiny tiny baby shoes i was like oh my gosh my kids were so tiny a long time ago <laughs> now they're eight and six and they're a lot a lot bigger but i forgot how tiny they can get even my husband was like oh my god they're so cute i saw these versace shoes and just little Givenchy shoes just so cute yeah very cute it's like a bougie Dubai lifestyle babies thank you very much for watching please subscribe to my channel like my videos and here we go we came to our favorite cafe in Dubai mall it's called home bakery and had a beautiful tea and a dessert so if you are here please try their desserts thank you so much for watching bye bye